Hey there, this is Al Yankovic, and I'm thrilled to read to you from my new book entitled My New Teacher and Me. It's a story about a boy on his first day of school and his unlikely, but absolutely true, stories. But first, if you don't mind, I'd like to uh, address some rumors that have popped up. Um, for, for the record, My New Teacher and Me is not an autobiography. Uh, for one thing, my grandfather never went to the moon, as far as I know. Um, also, I I've never dug up a dinosaur skeleton in my backyard. Okay, it's true I did have a teacher named Mr. Booth, and maybe, yes, I may have been to an island that defied gravity. But other than that, this is in no way autobiographical. Now, from the book. <clears throat> I said, hi, nice to meet you, sir. Billy's the name. See, a funny thing happened before the bus came. I was digging to China out in my backyard, and I almost was there when I hit something hard. Well, I dug, and I dug, and I dug a bit more, and discovered the skull of a real dinosaur. And I would have cleaned up, sir, but hey, I'm no fool. I just couldn't be late on the first day of school. For a second or two, Mr. Booth kind of froze. Then he walked up to me, and he looked down his nose. I don't tolerate nonsense. No, not one degree. And your story sounds highly unlikely to me. Why, of course it's unlikely, I said. Oh, by far. The awesomest things in the world often are. So, there you go. Billy tells his teacher a lot of stories. Stories that are in no way like anything I ever told my teachers. And you can read about them all, including Billy's visit to the two-headed cow farm and the time he picked blueberry muffins right off the trees in My New Teacher and Me.